Wafik and Anna, today we are gathered here to celebrate the love you have discovered in each other and to support the commitment you are about to make. Marriage is more than two people standing here repeating vows. It is a common search for the good and the beautiful, and the obligation is reciprocal. Two worlds collide with our hearts on the line. We were young and naive. We were wild, we were free. I don't want to leave your arms tonight. I'm falling, still falling. Remember that your love will always prevail in times of turmoil. It will drive you to not only learn and grow as individuals, but to become stronger partners together. As you join yourselves in marriage, there is a vast unknown future stretching out before you. Today, you enter as individuals, but you will leave here as husband and wife. By the power vested in me and the state of North Carolina, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. Anna Christina is loving, determined, supportive, genuine, and kind. She's passionate and compassionate, and I'm so proud of the woman she has become. She is a bundle of joy and surprises. Good news for you, Waf, they're mostly good ones. <laughs> Waf has always been respectful and kind with both Anna and the family. He's loving and a great partner for Anna. He makes Anna happy and he even cooks. I still remember the moment I saw Waf meet his soulmate. And that moment was 13 years ago when he met me in high school. <laughs> I want to thank you for being such a great partner to my friend and, and loving him for who he is. And I wish you a lifetime of health, happiness, and laughter. It's really hard to put into words your relationship. It's the way you look at each other, the way you make each other belly laugh and just how perfect your relationship makes sense. You're one of my favorite love stories, and I'm so grateful to call you my best friends. Oh, into the daylight, so open your